You are on a journey to prepare for Unit 3 test on quadratic functions with Anil Kumar. And here is question number 2. And this is related with finite difference application which we treated in question 1. Now the question here is, calculate second difference for the function y equals to minus 3x squared plus 2x minus 5. Now you can solve the question, pause the video and then look into my suggestions. Here is my suggestion. Most of the students, what will they do for this? Let's understand that part first. So they'll make a table of values, right? Now in the table of values, you can write the x values and the y values, which will be minus 3x squared plus 2x minus 5. And then you can plug in some x values, right? And the key values which you have been taught to plug is minus 2, minus 1, 0, 1, and 2. Once you put these values in here, then you can find the first difference and you will get ultimately the second difference, right? So you calculate these values and then you find the first difference, you say delta 1, and then you find the second difference, which is delta 2, and these will be constant, and then you get the answer. Well, that is a standard way of doing things, but it consumes a lot of time and it is prone to errors because you're doing so many calculations in a test paper for sure. There are chances of getting errors. Now, here is a cute way of doing it. That is what you have learned from me. And in the chapter also, which you might have ignored earlier, how is second difference related with the leading coefficient that is a big question to be answered so find the relation between leading coefficient which is a and second difference i write second difference like delta 2 means second difference do you know the relation between them if you know, then it takes a minute to answer this question, rather a second. Now, second difference is related with leading coefficient, and the relation is, let me write it big and bold here, the relation is that A is equals to second difference divided by 2. So that is the relation which you have to remember. And you kind of know it, but you need to register it. So A, the second difference, A is equal to second difference divided by 2. So from here, if you have to find the second difference, you can always calculate. And the second difference in this case will be, that means 2 times A, and A is minus 3 for you. So it is 2 times minus 3, that gives you the value of minus 6. So when you do all these calculations, the only number you're going to get here is going to be 2 times minus 3. That, that leading coefficient a is minus 3 for you, right? So you'll get 2 times minus 3 and your answer will be minus 6. And that is how you get second difference from the given equation. I hope you love that and I appreciate it. Thank you. Let's move on to the third question of unit 3 test.